Hello friends and welcome to another one-off, oh my god I almost threw something, one-off vlog. Uh, today I have the day off from work, I'm working tomorrow, but today I'm gonna go uh, looking for the henna brand that I use to color my hair because it's time for me to henna my hair. I'm seeing the, you know, you can't really see it in this video, but I'm seeing the reddish brown growing back. I like my natural hair color, but I've committed to the black. So now, I've committed to the darkness, you know? So now I have to go and look for the henna. I usually buy like 10 boxes at once because it's really hard to find them nowadays, but hopefully I can find it because it's been really hard. And uh, meeting my mom in a few minutes, and uh, after that, we're gonna go pick up Sal from work, and we are going to take my mom out for dinner in one of my favorite places in Gastown called Black Frog. They have amazing wings and great drinks, so we're gonna have a little girls' night out with my mom and with Sal, so that's gonna be really exciting. And yeah, I'm gonna bring you guys along. Bye, see you. Hi friends, so we made it home. I didn't get a lot of footage in from like our process of going and buying things, but um, we went to one of the shops that I really like to go, <laughs> Sal is singing in the back, stop! <laughs> We're, we went to one of the shops that I used to go to a lot when I was working in this aromatherapy shop. The shop is called, um, fuck I forgot it again, Welks, W-E-L-K-S and they have a lot of like really cool brands and very like uh, old school brands and really nice things and i bought myself a few little things just to treat myself so i got myself a smaller refill of this um pure castile soap castile soap i don't know how to pronounce it this one has some lavender in it and it's pretty popular i'm sure you guys have seen it these are not very <laughs> lucy's eating in the back i'm sorry for the noise um you've probably seen it everywhere it's a really old school basic product but a really good product and um, just got a very small 237 mil 237 mil version of it I really like this um, and then I've never tried this brand before they have a bigger size but the Marvis jasmine mint toothpaste it looked very old school and I really like that and it just jasmine mint sounded really nice to me um, and it's very little it's a tiny little toothpaste but I think I'm gonna really like it and I also got myself a Ro Roscoe Emmett Rosehip um, soap. Never ever tried this before, never heard of them, but it smells pretty divine, so I bought this one. This one has a rose, lemongrass, and French clay, and um, it sounds really nice, and it smells like rose petals, and that makes me very happy and uh quick update oh yeah i also got i also got this um little plant pot thing for sal she's a little foxy and i got her a little foxy one and i just couldn't resist this really fancy ass dish soap <laughs> it's just so like over the top and bougie and i just really fell in love with it and i got this and um a little update about luna she is doing a lot better 
Um, she hasn't been vomiting. She hasn't had diarrhea. That's a good thing. But every night we are giving her um, some of this paste. She hates it. She hates us after it. She hisses at us. She's never hissed at me before. So this breaks my heart, but it's for her health. And we're giving her some kind of... Um, has my address on it. We're giving her some medication for her vomiting and she's been doing a little bit better, so that's nice. But that's about it for today. Oh, and I found the henna that I was looking for. So there's a little story behind these hennas. I bought four boxes of each because I don't, I like to just get bulk at once because sometimes they all run out and the shop doesn't bring it for a couple months. Um, in the beginning, when I first started hennaing my hair, I used to use Amir's henna, so this is the brand that I used for a couple of years. The problem with this brand is from the shops that I used to purchase, um, maybe it was that batch that they made, but a couple of times when I had up my hair, it wasn't making it black enough. Like I would come out of the shower, it would look black. And when I would dry it, I would see that it's very light underneath. So it wasn't really coating my hair that nicely. It was really showing that there was a lot of inconsistency in the formula. And that was kind of disappointing. So I stopped using this and the shop owner is a really nice guy and he recommended this brand called Nurani. And um, I was using this one for a couple of years. It worked perfectly fine. And after a while, I found some inconsistencies with both of them. So I just realized they're very similar to each other. I wouldn't even be surprised if they're both made in the same place. You can't really go um, totally right with any of them. So. I just buy a bunch of boxes and I hope for the best 80% of the time it makes my hair super black and the other 20% not so black and I feel like I have to henna my hair again in a week or so and that's a lot of mess. It's it's every single time I henna my hair, my shower needs a full bleaching, it just dyes everything so I don't want to have to do this too often because when I do my full hair, it's a lot of hair and <laughs> a lot of it and there's also a lot of cleaning up to do. But um, I've purchased both of them and uh, hopefully one of them will work. I wouldn't recommend mixing the different brands because I'm not 100% sure about the formulations, if there's anything in one of them that would interact with the other badly. But um, usually when I head on my full hair, I have to use three boxes. So yeah, I will use three of the same brand just so that it doesn't burn my hair off because I don't know what's going to happen to my hair if I do that. But that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for joining me on another one-off video. It's been really fun hanging out with you guys and I've been really enjoying making these videos because it kind of shows you guys the other stuff that I'm into and the other things that I do. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this little vlog and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!